And if it's too slow, I can't control it. It's just not an option. And it just not doesn't perform, you know? It's hard to control when it goes that slow. I'm just saying. I think uh, somebody nicknamed the Red Rocker back in the 80s had a song called I Can't Drive 55, and that was part of the lyric. So, fun fact. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. God, I miss the 80s so much. That was my generation. That was my youth, and I miss those days. You know what I'm saying? You stupid bus. Really? I do not like slow drivers in real life, and you can see why I get very salty in, in game two. So, yeah, this game, this game, man, I swear, the AI has gotten so much worse over the years. I'm not kidding you. It's like the AI just can't get itself together. You'll come up to an off ramp like this one, and they'll just like not know what to do with themselves. They'll just sit there and go, I don't know how to drive. And they'll just stop in the middle of the road and then everybody jacks up. I remember I was in the, the fast lane in the left lane and a truck had just a, a random pickup truck just was stopped. And I'm thinking, really, dude, really? And I slammed into the back of his truck because I couldn't even tell I me. Mean, I literally like heard the tires squeak across this across the pavement and i'm like well that was 24 percent damage it cost me over a hundred thousand dollars in game to fix so that was fantastic so yeah be very very careful you know what i'm saying you got to be careful anyway so as i said we're i believe this is california we're going to um so it's been a while. I don't usually cruise that state a whole lot because it's too slow in 55. I'm just saying. I've been doing a lot of stuff in, like, Nebraska, you know, things like that, trying to get that all filled out and all that fun stuff with the contracts and fun stuff like that. Now I'm just doing regular freight and, uh, yeah. So anyway. Oh, kind of speed up again. Oop, that's the wrong way. There we go. Sometimes I don't know my left from my right. My right D-pad controls the, down, the the deceleration and the acceleration is on the other side of it. Oh, I bet you I'm going to have to pull over, aren't I? Are you going to make me pull over, you stupid thing? Oh, yay, I can bypass. I'm in Utah. This is Utah. Oh, God, that car. That car. No, no, no. Mm. You got an F-U horn for that. Slowing me down like that, you butt nugget. I swear these drivers, these drivers just really. I mean, look, if SCS wants to make these legitimately realistic, I mean, they've done a hell of a job so far. I will tell you that right now. Okay, so I gotta stay to the left. To the left, to the left. Alright, car. Oh, you suck. Ooh, 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 ooh. Slow down. Don't tap that wall. Don't eat that yellow snow. Just, why did I even have my signal light on? I don't know. See, this is how dumb I am. I would turn into a corner like that with my signal light on because I'm dumb. Anyway. <laughs> so, see, this is the kind of garbage. And then they slam on their brakes because they're stupid. Look at this garbage. Look at this garbage. Oh, my God. See, this is the kind of crap I don't even like in real life. Like, really, dude, now you decide to mur- Oh, my gosh. Ermagerd! Erm, oh, no, no, no. Getting up to speed. There we go. Oh, now I got to go to 65 now? Great. Yeah, that really messed me up, slowing down. See, that's what I'm talking about. They'll do that on a hill, and then you really lose all your momentum. God, that sucks. That is so obnoxious. Oh, my gosh. You know, and SCS has known about this forever and a day, and they've never fixed it. Sometimes I've really thought about going into the config file and just disabling all vehicles. Just say, screw it. There's no purpose to having these cars in the game if it's not going to work right. I get over to the other lane. So, anyway. 
Uh, but yeah, this is, you know, interesting. Um, I might at the end of this show you the mods I'm using. I don't know. Um, maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Maybe go fuck yourself. <laughs> if you know what the reference of that little saying is, uh, leave a comment below. Why not? Okay, now do I go to Las Vegas? Uh, or is it Salt Lake? No, it's Salt Lake. Okay, yeah, that's right. I hope that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go underneath the bridge. I've done that. Like I said, this GPS sometimes just throws me off. Because I don't use the audio anymore. I turned it off because my... Ugh. I used to use the... There was a mod for the Google Map version. And for whatever reason, that just disappeared. Can't even find it on the... On the, uh, on the uh, Steam Workshop. Okay, so now I have to go... Ooh, is it this way? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it's this way. God, I just slowed way down. Oh my god. Okay, well, let's get this back up to speed. No, actually, I better not go fast around this corner because it looks like it's a tight corner. Okay. I'm driving, okay. It is you, okay. Yeah, I'm driving like a grandma. I know. I'm trying to baby my truck. What am I? What am I? What am I doing that for? Because I'm smart, not a dumb dumb. I'm just saying. So, I don't know if anybody else notices this in this game, but whenever you color your truck, like you paint it whatever color, it always seems like the game like like paints the same colors that you use. So I've got a blue, kind of a bluish to fade black truck, and then there's like blue trucks everywhere. Why is that even a thing? Like, why does that game do that? Why can't I not see like a banana freaking, you know, Peterbilt or whatever? Like, cause I just actually saw that the other day. I actually saw a banana colored Peterbilt the other day. <laughs> I think it was a 379 um, truck. Uh, also, speaking of uh, Peterbilt, they did have a video release recently. Um, where they uh, showcase the new 598 or 589s that are coming out. Uh, I believe it's in the next uh, cycle of Peterbilt's uh, things. I think they're actually, I think they're already built and they're just gonna start delivering them this year, I think, I don't know. And um, so it'll be interesting if SCS will add that as a either a DLC or if they'll add it in, into the base game. So, might be a cool truck. They they took a lot of the design cues from the original truck, from the 370, uh, the 379, or 378, whatever, uh, 379, whatever it is. And the 589 is, you know, gonna have some of those cues. They got rid of the split window that the 379 has, or the 389 has. I'm sorry, 389. There's too many freaking numbers. I can't math. I'm sorry. I'll shut up. Um, <laughs> yeah, right. Like I'll ever shut up. So basically. From what, I under, from what I was understanding by the documentary that they did was there was a lot of design cues that everybody loves in the uh, 389, and they're bringing those over to the 589. So that's interesting. I kind of like how they're doing that. I don't know. If I'm, I'm not a Peterbilt guy anymore. I used to be as a kid. I got more into Kenworths when I got older. I just like how they looked. I love the, I love the large... Uh, you know, filters on the sides, and just looks like a, it looks like there's a really awesome truck. You know, it's just got power. I'm just saying, it's all the power. So, man, I wish I was more stable with my joysticks. Wait a minute, that doesn't sound right. Uh, context. <laughs> so, but yeah, um, that was a really cool thing they're doing. And this truck, oh good, he got over. I think, no, he did not get over because he's a dum-dum. And this is where you start losing inertia because trucks like this, which do not belong in these lanes, and yes, I know I'm guilty of the same thing. Stupid Dunkin' Donuts. Get on my way. Look at I mean, this is garbage, man. Like this is severe. This is like garbage. 
Like, why is why do these trucks just do this? Like, why are they so like this? Where they just make it creep up on them? Like, I don't get this at all, man. I don't get it at all. I, I don't understand it. I'm just saying I don't understand it. You know, then it makes you have to downshift and, you know, try to get back up to speed and whatever. It's just so dumb. And then they'll slow down again. And I guarantee this guy will not bother getting over until he's, like, way over there. Yep, and then, of course, I'm trapped now. Okay, screw it. Oh, God, I gotta freaking do this. Okay, well, sorry, truck, I had to cut you off because this stupid thing said, hey, you gotta go get weighed because of reasons. Reason for you being a fat truck. You overweight. I'm about to stop off and get gas soon, too, because I'm at a quarter of a tank. And I need to uh, fill this thing up, so we'll have to find a gas station soon. Come on. Come on, mother trucker. Let's go. You slow. Alright. Come on. Come on. Inch your way up there. Come on. Just get the tip. Get the tip. Let's go. There we go. I did. Really? Okay, F you. I'm not gonna... Okay, it did work. That is so lame. God, I don't like that it does that. I do not like that it does that, ladies and gentlemen. I do not like it. No, sir, I don't. I gotta find a gas station soon. So, anyway. I will say, though, I feel like I've gotten better at this game. Like, I don't crash nearly as much. And, you know, I try to do some things that are legit, but other things I just could not care about. You know, I don't have sleep on or the, uh, you know, the, that thing I don't have uh, violations on. Because, I mean, that takes away from the fun. I'm just driving. I mean, I just want to cruise, man. I don't need no stinking laws, man. I'm just saying I want to drive. So... Come on. One thing I was kind of sad about with the uh, with this truck is that it doesn't allow for Big T's uh, light mods. Um, oh, this game. Oh, shoot. Okay, sorry, buddy. I'm going to cut you off. Sorry. Oh, there goes my trailer. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. That's what we call some really bad driving, but hey. Just a scratch. Tis but a scratch. All right, let's see. Up this way. I don't care about the other way because it's construction zone. That is, by the way, that is one thing I wish they would do with the, uh, with the, you know, the areas that you can't cross into. Make them into actual construction zones. Don't do the stupid like, oh hey, we're gonna put these stupid cones up or these bar like these yellow barriers up. Actually, put realistic construction zones up. That would be really cool. I'm just saying. Wouldn't that be awesome? So, oh, I gotta go to the stop sign to get gas. Oh, you, oh, of course, you can't go through there. You can't go there at all. No, of course not. See, like that, where those uh, X's are? That should be... That should be construction signs, you know? And really, you don't really want traffic to go that way. I know they have to do that because, you know, that's future builds, if it ever is gonna get built, because God knows how much stuff is actually... You know, supposedly going to be built and never is and all this other crap, so... Ooh, there's a casino. Well, aren't we the special ones? I'm just saying. Should we go gamble, folks? Should we go gamble? Huh? Should we? Should we go gamble? Yeah? Maybe? Place your bets? Should we go stop? Should we make a payment? Should we do a thing? Maybe? I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong. I'm going to go to the very end because that's where the gas pumps are that I need. So, anyway. Okay. Let's make our turn here. Not get hung up on that sign because that always sucks if you do. Uh, where are you at? You were over there. Good. Oop. That's a curb check. That is a curb check. All right. 689 miles to go. All right, let's see which one's filled. I think I will try this one over here. I'm probably gonna be too tight. Yeah, I'm probably too tight. I'm about to back up. 
Okay. Oh, not far enough up. Not far enough up. Oh, I'll actually be able to get that. Okay, there we go. Cool. Stop. Stop. All right, shut the engine off. Let's get some gas. Downshift a little bit here. I love how you can actually just downshift in this game. Like you're just your engine's off, but you can still shift. That's actually pretty cool. That's so many gallons this is going to eat up. Okay, 160 gallons, $653 at $4.07. Yeah, legit. Very much legit. And bloody testing. All right, let me see if I can clear that. Oh, yeah, I'll have no problem doing that. Cool. All right, fantastic. All right, let's get, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's go drive over here. All right, there's a 3M truck. Yeah, Real Companies and Signs is a pretty cool mod. Um, I actually do run, like, whenever I run with my brother, he doesn't use mods at all. He actually plays the vanilla game. And I'm like, you sure you don't want, like, more detail? He's like, nope, I don't. I'm like, okay, man, okay. So he uh, he and I, if we do play, I have an, well, my other profile I've actually got set up for absolutely no. Uh, oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare run into me. I will... Mom will smack you up here in your head. Shown bitch. Um, so we'll play a vanilla game. And I got a profile that's just vanilla. God, it's hard to play vanilla. I'm going to tell you that right now. It is very hard to play vanilla. So it's very annoying to play. But oh, <laughs> look at that. Wow. That's what you call threading that needle, man. I thank God I stayed in that center lane like that. Holy crap, that would have been no bueno. No bueno deluxe edition. I'm just saying. God, that would have sucked. That would have sucked. It's like I checked over my shoulder, and there was nobody there. And I see that a-hole, and I'm like, yeah, you're there now. Fantastic. God. So anyway, folks, hope you are enjoying this video. Uh, like I said, this one I actually might leave uncut and just process it this way. You know, I don't know if I'll edit it. I don't know because, I mean, it'll take a long time for this thing. To, I mean, we're talking hours before this thing even uploads. So because, you know, my YouTube internet sucks. All right, there we go. Back on the road again. Back on the road. Uh, we should be able to make the 600 mile trip. There we go, fantastic. Remember my cruise control? Yes, we do. That's one thing too. Um, whenever you shut your vehicle off, cruise control is never remembered like your last speed. No, you gotta reset it. So I never, you know, whatever, I mean. <laughs> whatever so um, regarding the mods mostly what I have is just for cosmetics um, I don't run like Z mods anymore uh, I found out when I had issues with like traffic lights for missing or floating signs which is one of my old convoy videos that is most likely due to Z mods apparently that is a thing and an issue okay I need to get over now because I'm going faster than this container or this tanker truck probably got some fuel yeah it's Amerigas yeah that's a good way to get explosions is smack into one of those trucks the tunnel of love ew it's the tunnel of love ooh. actually it's not dark enough <laughs> and too short <laughs> that's what she said anyway so yeah um what the hell was I saying? I don't even know. I have no idea what I was just saying, but that's okay. Move along. Um, but yeah, if I do upload this video, it's well, I will upload the video. I may make this two parts. I don't know. If I do, it'll just be like a quick fade out at the at the cut point, and then I'll have like two videos to upload for you guys. So we'll see. And everybody's slowing. Yeah, everybody's brake checking right now. Fantastic. Fantastic. Oh, God. 
this is so bad. I don't like when they do this because I'm on a controller and it sucks to have to do this driving, steering with a thumbstick. It sucks. It's bad, I'm sorry. I'm just saying. I still have fun though. I, I really just look at this game as like, okay, it's a game, it's fun. I like to drive, I like the sound of my truck. It's like, you know, it's a manly sound, you know? It sounded like a real dude, you know, it's like, Rrr. I don't know what I was saying there. Never mind. Ignore that. Reverse that, ignore that. So, anyway. But uh, again, huge shout out to my new subscribers. Thank you so much. Um, like I said, I was really surprised that anybody would even want to check out content on here because it's so old. I'm not relevant. <laughs> well, maybe I can be relevant once again. Who knows? Because I'm a special skittle. I'm just saying. So maybe one of these days I'll do an entire video with Purple. You know, Purple will drive a truck. That might be that might be interesting or annoying. It depends on your point of view. Maybe I care. Maybe I don't care. Maybe go fuck yourself. Dude, what is up with this slow traffic? Like, look at this garbage. Like, seriously? Do I, oh, I just. OK, well, screw you. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah. That's what that's uh, that's how you do. <laughs> you can bypass the station. Fantastic. Yeah. That car. I'm sorry, folks. That car did me very dirty. He was not going the speed limit. The speed limit is 75 miles an hour. Was he doing 75? No, he was not doing 75. No, he was doing. I don't even know what my speedometer said. Check out the replay. By the way, I think we just passed uh, Toxic Atlas's uh, billboard. Hey, Toxic, are you ready for a rendezvous with Dina? If you want to know that inside joke, go join up with the McJevis RP server where you can find out all about the Dina and Atlas relationship. I just saying. See what I mean? Like, look at this garbage. Like, this this truck. This this butt nugget. Screw this. See, slower traffic must keep to the right. That is the law. Why is it such a thing? Ugh. Oh, I'm going too fast, aren't I? Well, darn it, gosh barfold, I'm going too fast. I may get arrested by the popo. Would not be sad, or would it be funny? Actually, I don't even know what it would be. It'd be crazy. Am I being weird? Am I weird? Am I weird? Yeah, let's go with that. So, anyway. I hope you guys are entertained and having fun and all that good stuff. Because, hey, man, this world is absolutely fucking chaos right now. And we need some we need some yucks and some laughs and all this stuff. Because, man, I'll tell you something. This world is going to hell quickly. But uh, I'm not going to go down that path because reasons. Because you didn't come here to listen to me bitch about the world. You came here to watch me drive a truck and smash into things and say, show bitch. So... It's Bob Ross. Let's paint a happy little tree. Use your imagination. See? Oh, we've just committed. <laughs> to be honest, I do like Bob Ross a lot. When I was uh, building guitars um, as part of my one of my little hobbies, that was one thing I'd actually have on the background when I was actually having a hand sand. Uh, the bodies and the end, all that was I just literally would put Bob Ross on and it's just very, it's like very chill. Like I'm not even stressed. I'm just like, cause people don't like to sand like guitars. They just don't like doing it. Cause there's so much involved to make it a, to make the surface really flat. Oh God, no, 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 no. You didn't see that. 
I deny anything. I deny all things. You did not see that at all. Close your eyes. That did not happen. So Bob Ross actually is a... Uh, he was really, he was a really fun guy to watch. Um, he passed away back in the 90s from, I think it was lymphoma, which is really sad. Everybody that watched him really enjoyed what he did. I, I wanted to learn to paint like him. I actually have some canvases. Um, they're smaller. They're not 12 by 24s or uh, 18 by 24s, whatever he used. Um, they're smaller, but... Um, you can still do a lot with them. And you know, I wanted to learn the technique of wet and wet and all that cool stuff and work with oils. And I probably could do it without, you know, any issues. It's just that I just never really cracked down to buy the rest of the stuff, like a proper, like an easel and the paints themselves, because, you know, his paints are very specific for the pet, for the technique. They're very, they're, they're very thick and they're very dry. Um, you know, the, it's like the consistency of frosting. Like, cake frosting is about how thick this paint is. And, um... So, I never, I never, uh... Learned it, but I probably, I probably could. It probably wouldn't be terribly difficult. And, I mean, I don't mind painting happy trees or a nice little lake or whatever. Or, you know, a nice scenery like that. Because that would be pretty cool. I don't consider myself an art, you know, an artist or anything like that. Like, somebody who's just really talented. Like, no. Nah. But um, I have a good imagination, and I think I can I can do some things. I'm pretty creative. Do I sound like I'm bragging? Am I bragging? Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm kidding. I am kidding. But I am. Oh my God, people, get off your freaking brakes! Oh my God, I am. This is terrible. Like, this is three in the morning traffic. Are you kidding me? Like, what driver is out this late at night? Trucks are usually out this late. Traffic like this is not out this late, typically. Ooh, that was a bendy bend in the K-rail I don't like. That was a that was a cutout I did not like at all. No, sir, that made me very uncomfortable. Good lord, dude. Jank driving much. Folks, I'm probably not going to edit any of this video, so you can see just how bad this AI really is. Oh my good golly gosh, this is so freaking annoying. Uh, looks like I keep going straight. God, I wish these cars would just turn off this road. It is getting very obnoxious. I am not kidding. Dude, sometimes, man, this game just does, it does piss me off. But then again, I say, look at the game. I don't care if I wreck my truck. <laughs> I'm a millionaire. <laughs> I got $59 million in the bank right now, and I'm good. You know, I've got 10 drivers, and, you know, why not? I did actually cut my staff in half. I literally, I literally got rid of, like, half of my drivers. Okay, screw this car. Seriously, screw that car. Yeah, this is the thing I don't understand. Like, why they've never fixed this at all? Like, why the, why these cars just seem to, like, just want to go slow? And then, you know, you've got inertia because you're a bigger vehicle. And then they just, like, hey, I'm going to jam on my brake because I'm dumb, dumb. So annoying. Oh, my God. That sign is not lit. <laughs> lit. What a weird phrase. Like, oh, my God, that's so lit. Or what is the new one that, that a lot of kids say nowadays when they, like, look at themselves in the mirror like, slay. Like, what does that even mean? Of course you look freaking cool. Yeah. But slay? Really? I mean, there's slayer! You know, great band. But not slay. I'm just saying. Do you want some asthma, too? <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing that driving drunk. Nope, I am loud, obnoxious, and boisterous. Deal with it. And deal with the fact I just created... Good God, I've got all this damage on my truck. I don't even want to look at the, the, the price tag of this now. Seriously. Like, for real, this truck is just... Wow. This is what happens, folks, when you don't have a steering wheel.